Okay, welcome back to Ocarina of Time. We just got the boss key, and, um... You know what I'd really like? I'd really like an easy way to get back to uh, the entrance of the temple, but I don't think they're gonna give that to me. I could just, like, do a little song and dance, or, uh, <laughs> I don't know, use uh, Furore's Courage or something. Furore's Wind? Furore's Wind? Whatever it's called? I don't know. Now I don't even know the names of things. It's, it's a very tragic situation. Anyway. Um, do I want to turn the volume down, like, just one notch? Yeah, just one notch. That was two notches. Um, anyway. Uh, this woke nightmare will end. Thank God for Elon Musk and his shit post memes. Uh, please, no. No, we don't, we don't want that. We don't want any more of that, and quite frankly, we don't agree with it. Um, so, how's everybody's uh, Wednesday? Because I'm recording this on a Wednesday. But, um, I know you guys are probably watching this on the, uh, the ninth day of the week, Grog Day, my favorite day of the week. I think I made it too soft. I know, I know, it breaks it breaks the immersion of the experience when you can see my like Mac volume. Oh, I don't have the I don't have the water on Let's see. I want the water on the top the top of the top, you know, so I can get up there. Yeah. So how do I do that? Can I just do it like this? No, wait, wait, wait. I think I have to do it like this. Yeah. You go in here. And then what? And then you hit the thing. Oh, the tectite's gonna come and fall on my head, right? Like a spider falling on my head. I hate that. It's like my worst nightmare. Are you ballsing me? Are you Tim Wallsing me? What was that bonking noise? Dude, just get out of here. Nobody likes you. I have such an issue with these. They're all over this temple. Frankly, this temple needs to call an exterminator. You know, they need to call Orkin. Orkin needs to help these dudes with uh, these guys. The rental company. <laughs> yeah, the rental company for um, for the water temple. The, the water temple's landlord. Okay. Watch how fast I can play this song, just kind of rolling my thumb over the C buttons. All I just have to do is like roll my thumb from left to right and you can play it really fast. That's what I like so much. Like I used to uh, play this game on Wii Virtual Console where the C buttons are all mapped to like a second analog stick basically. And, like, the idea of having C buttons is a really weird sort of concept that, you know, like, most modern uh, consoles got rid of that anyway, and they, they just have a second analog stick anyway, but... No, what? Are you serious? Come on. Oh, you're gonna me. Oh, I can just, I can just roll. Wait, can I? Fuck off. No, no, I can't. Oh, they changed it. It's changing. No, fuck. Why is this the biggest piece of shit since that one's part episode? The biggest piece of shit since now. That's, that's impossible, dude. That's straight up impossible. I can't fuck with this timing. I hate that many times. Actually, I'm trying to walk. No, come on. Look, I don't want to be stuck in this room for the whole rest of the episode. Are you me? Come on. I was so close. There we go. There we go. Come on. 
What was that? That was the most atrocious... That isn't normal water over there. That's blue jello. Anyway. This is a really cool cutscene. Um, it's like, oh, it's the point of view of the monster. It's kind of like, it does the Jaws thing. Uh, in my opinion, I like uh, Georg from Majora's Mask. It does this a little better, but this is fine. Oh my goodness, it's right behind you. It's right behind you. It's, it's a dick. Kidding. It's like it's like a, a jello like uh water thing. Oh god, I hate that splashing noise. It's it's annoys me. So basically just keep uh Navi targeted on this thing. Really? Okay, I have three fairies, shoot, so we should be fine. Good. Throw me onto the spikes. That's what they're there for. Okay, where are you? So it's gonna make that sound. It's like glug 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 glug, and then it's gonna come out of the water, and then it's gonna like be inside the tentacle, kinda. And then you hook shot it, you pull it out of the tentacle, and then it, it goes and it goes back in the tentacle. Day of the tentacle. That's a good video game. Oh, there you go. Come here. Come here. Okay. I got it twice that time. I don't know, maybe I can get it more than twice. Okay, so you want to stay far from the tentacle? Maybe. I like how the tentacle just, like, ripples. Okay, it was moving too much there. Can't really get it when it's moving too much. so fast. Like, what kind of crazy amoeba is this? Also, like, whose idea was it to let, oh, let's have you fight an amoeba. Like, who was high? And was like, you know what? Let's have Link fight an amoeba. That was, that was a dumb move. Please don't, please don't hurt me. Please don't hurt my family. Come on. Stop going back in the water. <laughs> okay, apparently the tentacle can still hurt me, even without the... I thought the amoeba was, like, the brains of the operation, so I thought, like, the tentacle couldn't hurt you without the amoeba inside it. I feel like I'm making no sense anyway. I feel like I'm talking about, like, lizard people and, like, brain worms, except that is an actual thing. Brain worms... Brain worms. Welcome to America. Politics. Brain worms. Oh, get away from the water, please. I feel it's like an M. Night Shyamalan plot. It's like, oh my god, get away from the water. There's two tentacles, what? That's not fair. They're ganging up on me. There's a whole family of tentacles. We got the mama tentacle. We got a uh, day of the tentacle. Oh. I just fucking like walked off the edge of a cliff with a selfie stick. That's what that was. Oh, I had a chance there. Anyway, I'm not taking any chances. God, could this fight be any slower and more annoying and more boring? Yes, it could. If it was a fight from Star Wars Shadows of the Empire. So I just watched Star Wars Shadows of the Empire for the N64. And it literally, it has a bunch of boss fights in it where it's like, it's like this, uh, big, like, walking robot, just, like, walking around, 
and like it has these uh, dangerous attacks that you have to avoid and it's like walking around it's like you know shooting at you or whatever and then you have to like run around and turn around and shoot it and like shoot a specific like weak, weak spot and it doesn't have a health bar, it has a percentage, so it'll be like going down like 1%, 2%, and it's just like these boss fights will be like 7 or 8 minutes of like the same thing. And then there's this boss fight with Boba Fett, where Boba Fett's like constantly flying around and it's near impossible to hit him. And you have to fight him like on a jetpack the whole time. So that game just looks really frustrating, like I, I have no plans to play that game anytime soon. Oh, don't you dare. Come back here, you stupid piece of shit. Sherry. I, I walked right into it. I literally walked into it. <laughs> you couldn't have at least thrown me into the platform. Link's fucking drowning. Oh my god. So dramatic. Mifa's grace is ready. What are the other ones? Baruch's protection is now ready to roll. Can I have tea? Can I have your tea? Please? No! I, I don't really know what to say to this. This is like... Ugh. I don't hate the water temple, but I hate the combination of... The water temple, Morpha, and Dark Link, and the Tektites. I just think all those things together make it a bad temple. I like the music, I like the a atmosphere, I like the aesthetic, I like the layout and the design, I don't hate it. Also, I feel like that's too loud. Come on, just let me grab you. It's like Donald Trump. Just let me grab you. You're a woman, you will obviously want to be grabbed. The He-Man Woman Haters Club is what it is. And then, of course, we got What is a Woman by Matt Walsh. Like, anyone wants to hear that man tell you what a woman is. A guy who thinks that, like, 18-year-olds are fertile. Anyway, I don't get what the big, like, obsession over what is a woman, and, like, why that's such a genuine, like, yeah. Anyway, <laughs> what did I say at the beginning of the episode? I was like, oh, no politics, I promise. That took 15 minutes. We're already at 15 minutes, and I've literally, the only thing I've done in this video is beat Morpha and complain about politics. Also, the, <laughs> the water gets sucked onto the ceiling, and then it's like, like the exorcist, the exorcist, the exercise, pronunciation, it's like the exorcist, but with water. The water defies gravity. And I will try defying gravity. Where's the heart container? Okay. Like, I don't want to miss a heart container. I don't want to, like, I want to finish this game with 20 hearts. There's, like, no way around that. Um, so if we're already at 16 minutes, do I want to just end the video there? Like, after this whole, this, all this bullshit? Yay, Chamber of the, the Super Smash Brothers. The, the brothers. Chamber of the Fish Lady, yay, put on some clothes, Fish Lady. I'm gonna have to uh, upgrade my Mermonkey.
tower to, uh, like, um, I don't know. I do enjoy, I do enjoy the new Mermonkey Tower a lot for anyone who plays that game. It seems to be a pretty popular game. I feel like, just ashamed of myself that, like, I've only had that game for a year and, uh, my playtime's already at 160 hours. Like, so embarrassed. I'm so embarrassed. Why am I, like, s addicted to such a repetitive, like, boring game? I don't know, because it's addicting. Because it makes my brain, haha, -ha brain go burr. Anyway. Respectfully? I'm just looking respectfully. It looks more like ice than water. Like, oh, the theory is that the water temple was originally going to be the ice temple, but then they turned it into the ice cavern. I don't know. It's the this whole theory that comes from, like, the six medallions, and there was originally a light temple, and then the forest medallion looks more like wind, so there was originally a wind temple. Oh, and look at this. Lake Hylia is uh, going to get refilled. So that means uh, we can do all sorts of things. All sorts of cool things. As the water rises, the evil is vanishing from the lake. Dude, you did it! I sure did. Sheik, why are your eyes red? Are your eyes just naturally red? Or do you just, like, smoke a lot of weed? See, I, like, that's a pretty obvious joke. Oh, seeing that sun reminds me there's something you can do with the sun. I just remembered that. I totally forgot that until now. Look at that, dude. Look at the sun. Together, you and Princess Rudo destroyed the evil monster. She didn't do much. She didn't do shit. She didn't do shit in Jabu Jabu's belly, and she didn't do shit this time. Whatever. I'm just... I'm just trolling. I'm trolling, and I'm rolling. See, like, her, her, uh, or his, like, p not pupils, irises are red, but, like, what's the, the white part of your eye? What's that called? <laughs> I sound so dumb. Like, uh, like if you smoke weed, the part around your, it doesn't change your eye color, it just makes, like, the white part of your eye turn red. Or a little bit red, like... Oh, wow, look at that sun. I think you can do only do it, like, right after uh, sunrise. Let me check. This says something about when water fills the lake, shoot for the morning light. So, I mean, is it still technically morning? No, I guess not. All right. Well, uh, we're already at 20 minutes, so I think we're going to end this episode here. Next time on Ocarina of Time, we're going to do some uh, post, uh, post shenanigans, post water temple shenanigans, also known as pre shadow temple shenanigans, also known as uh, just using the long shot to clean up whatever other stuff we missed. Okay, I'm ending the episode. Bye.